Hi everyone, it's Jim Hamill with Pocono Television Network and each and every year the call goes out for folks all across the Pocono Mountains to help those in need, especially around the holiday season. And each and every year, that need is greater. And so charities like the Pocono Mountains United Way, which supports nonprofits and programs, always relies on donations from the public to help. And so we have several charities that always activate around this time of year to give back to our communities and the people in them, including the Salvation Army of East Stroudsburg and the Shower for Charity in Honesdale for the Wayne County Children's Christmas Bureau. Even before December arrives, the bell ringers are out in force across the Pocono Mountains. And for one cold December day, Merry Christmas! so is Michael G. Stanton showering for charity in Honesdale. Both charity efforts have been making a difference for decades. I stand outside literally in a claw tub in boxer shorts uh, on, on Main Street and I will stay in there until we raise $20,000 or until, as I say, you know, my lips turn blue and they tell me, you got to get out. But, you know, I've turned different colors in the past. Stanton takes a cold shower for the Wayne County Children's Christmas Bureau, getting a boost from sponsors and each and every penny donated during the hours long charity shower, sometimes in the frigid cold. There have been some times literally when it was a wind chill of zero and there's been times when it's <laughs> been in the teens when I go out and I will stay there until we raise $20,000. And I've never gotten out when we didn't have the money. Um, mm. Literally ice on my hair, on the hair of my arms, my legs. No matter snow or ice, the Salvation Army puts out the call for volunteers to ring in this season of giving, taking donations at locations all across the region, eight hours a day, right up until Christmas Eve. That's a lot of hours covering lots of stores. Um, we need lots of volunteers to keep that going. Um, so they can call us to volunteer to cover one of the kettles. Even if all they have is a couple hours, that's helpful to keep that covered. Majors Martha and John Wheeler with the East Stroudsburg Salvation Army sat down with us last December to talk about how they help thousands each year thanks to the donations from so many this season. Salvation Army Kettle started back in 1891, San Francisco. They were trying to feed about 25,000 people Christmas dinner. Um, since then, we've been doing kettles, but since then what we do has changed. It's not just about the food anymore. It gets into sheltering and toys and all sorts of other things that we take care of. Um, the need is great, so we keep putting the kettles out. Nowadays, there are also virtual kettles and other ways to give right at the Salvation Army website. And on December 10th, you can give to Michael G. and the Shower for Charity and see why he keeps doing it each and every year. This year's goal, $25,000. And over the years, he estimates he's raised more than $350,000 for the Children's Christmas Bureau in Wayne County. I'm gonna leave there and, and get in warm clothes and go to a, a warm house. Mm -hmm. there, there are folks, kids that they don't have a warm coat or they don't have a house that's warm. Maybe they have a house, but it, they can't afford the heat bill or, or whatever. So, okay, so I'm cold for a little while. Like whoop de doo Whether it's volunteers ringing the bell for donations or a frosty shower outside in the elements, these charities know why they work so hard to provide help to others now and all year long. What motivates me is just remembering the people in need. I call them the hidden generation people who have deep needs that it seems like society doesn't even realize they exist. I remind myself of those people and just keep plugging through and get done what I need to do. Thanks to all who give mm. and to all who give of themselves, not just money. It's not just about money. It's about giving of ourselves and, and God blesses us for, for yeah. mm. our sacrifices in that way. We have so many generous people in, in Wayne and Pike County. It's and, and beyond, but I mean, so thank you. It, yeah, it is awesome. During this season of giving, consider these and other charities, helping the Pocono Mountains and its people. Jim Hamill for the Pocono Television Network. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the Pocono Tourism YouTube channel and click the bell button below to be the first to watch new videos. You can also click the link on the screen to watch more episodes of Pocono Mountains Magazine.